Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we will talk about Schedule Refresh in Power BI service. So before we go down to what Schedule Refresh is, uh, let's break down Schedule Refresh uh, before its definition. So I just want to give you an example about uh, fresh fruits. So our data in Power BI service is like fruit in a basket, where we want our reports and charts to show the latest and juiciest information. Okay, so we don't want that our report is not updated and our report is, you know, backdated, which was last updated in the month of January, February or whatever it is. So we don't want that to happen. We want a report to be updated every day or every week with the latest data into it. Okay, so that is the problem. So if you say if our fruit basket doesn't automatically update, we would stuck with old stale fruits so as i was saying if we don't update our fruit basket you know we will left with old fruits into it okay similarly in power bi also if we do not refresh our data on time like every day or every week our reports will show an outdated information which will impact the business so if our report is not updated it will be a big impact on the business that we are running on okay so what is the solution for this? The solution for this is a schedule refresh. Okay. So a schedule refresh is like having a magical routine wherein you tell a Power BI when to check for a new data into it and update it accordingly. Okay. So schedule refresh in Power BI service is like a scheduled delivery service for your data. Okay. So it keeps your reports and dashboard constantly updated with the latest information so you are always working with fresh relevant data without any manual effort. So that is a definition about schedule refresh. So I hope till now you might have understood what schedule refresh is. So what are the benefit of using this schedule refresh? No manual intervention is required. Your data will be updated with the latest data. That is the second benefit. And once you publish this report, the client will have a latest data with them. Okay, so let's go to Power BI service and see how we can use this schedule refresh option. Okay, so I am in Power BI service and let's go and see how we can set up a schedule refresh. So to do so, what we will have to do is go to our workspace. As of now, I'm going to the test workspace and I will select the data source. I will click on this more option and go to settings. Now, once I go to the settings, you will be able to see the settings for this particular database or the data source that we are using. In our previous video, we have already set up the gateway and cloud connection along with the data source credentials. Now you can see uh, an option which says refresh. So I'll just click on refresh. Now this button is off. Let's click and on this service. Now it is asking us for the frequency. Do we want this report to be refreshed daily or weekly? So as of now, let's take this as weekly. It is asking us to select the time zone. So I want this time zone. I'll keep the time zone. And I want this reports to be refreshed weekly twice in a week. So let's take as Sunday and uh, let's take Sunday and Wednesday. So I want my report to be refreshed on Sunday and the other one on Wednesday and what time I want to add the time so let's take I want this reports I want this report to be refreshed at 10 a.m. in the morning and if I want to add another time I can do that I want this report to be refreshed again at 10 in the evening or at night Okay, so what will happen is on every Sunday, this report will be refreshed first in the morning and second time in the night. Okay, similarly on Wednesday, it will refresh first at 10 a.m. in the morning and 10 a.m., 10 p.m. at night on same day. Okay, now there is one option which says send refresh failure notification. So what it does is if your refresh is failed, it will send the owner of this semantic model that 
your data refresh is failed uh, with an error message okay now if you don't want to get an failure message you can just uncheck it but if you want that okay you want to know whether this uh, refresh is successful or not you can just click on this and click on apply so once i click on apply you will get a notification stating that your updates to the adventure a refresh schedule change have been set okay now let's do one thing let's go to the workspace again now we will do one thing uh, let's try to refresh this particular uh, database let's click on refresh now you can see it is getting refreshed and once this is refreshed you will get a notification stating that your adventure works product is refreshed successfully okay all right so yes that's all about in today's video hope you like this video please comment below and subscribe to our channel have a great day